I'm still thinking about uh, hashtags and for example X Street Arts is uh, Exeter Street Arts Festival. The, the was the start of one this summer in August, the, the last weekend in August, uh, but it was cancelled at the last last moment. And I think that a YouTube channel, uh, M MIDI TV, is going to start sometime soon. And since um, I'm only going to do one more show, a uh, radio show, pre-recorded show, I'm going to start talking about it now and um, reactivate it whenever that YouTube channel is launched uh, because I, I want to try and find out if there are any reliable analytics or statistics that would help track um, what is done as tweets and whether it shows anything happening later as YouTube and um, once the pandemic is over whether that affects anything in real life because um, if there were performances going on then presumably the more tweets or social media and YouTube that happens the more people know about a particular music track or music performer and uh, reality or performance real life live um, music would benefit at some point but how do you track all of that is it is it a process and I, I ask that to try to interest people who um, know about Deming ISO 9000 production methods uh, statistics as part of a system because I'm sure this e either relates to social media analytics or else there are people who already know um, how these things fit together. It may just be me who, who hasn't noticed how the words are similar to some other words. Um, but I, 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 I just don't know anyway how, how, you, how you approach tracking a hashtag such as X Street Arts in social media, um, video, sound and eventually some some form of reality so uh, in the in the next one I hope to have permission to reuse bits of video as part of this radio show and any any comments on this sort of thing very much welcome <laughs>